do is just let the kids, you can have the whole thing uh, not attached, okay? And you can just say, okay, um, this is a little digital clock. This is, this is called a potato clock. How do you think that we could make this work? For them to try it, just putting the two against the sink. I think, uh, I think they, they, will, they, will, they will think the sink and the copper. So look at the periodic table. Tell me what you know about the charge on that. Uh huh. And perhaps if you know anything about electricity, you know there has to be a flow of electrons from negative to positive. They're coming back around to either side of the of the device. The other thing that you want to ask them is say, okay, so it's working. I have electricity. Where's the energy coming from? Potato. Potato. I like all of your ideas. Let's take a look at this activity. And after we do the activity, let's come back to the potato and let's figure out how this is working. To go from here to here, right, and then from here to there, and then from here to there. And you have to have the grid. The anode, the cathode, and the grid. Those are the three points. Right. Is, is, is there any kind of like corrosion going on? Anode that's being, no, no, the cathode that's being used? No. Yeah, because it's, well, so electrons are leaving the positive one, right, and going to the negative one, so the positive one's going to run out.